In this video we will show you how to use the H2O Audio app. The app is free and available on Apple App Store and Google Play Store. Download the app on your phone. Before you start, make sure you have done the Bluetooth pairing with your phone. If not, pause this video and come back once you have done it. Step 1. Press and hold the play button to turn on the device. Then, open the app, and click the link your device button. Once the app finds your headphones, it will be listed below. Click the connect button to confirm the connection. Your app is now ready. The app has three pages or menus, device, library, and load. The device page allows you to update your software, see the memory usage, and battery level. The library page allows you to manage your music files and folders in the device memory. The load page allows you to load music from Bluetooth to the Playlist Plus. Loading audio, set the timer or the duration you want for the loading. For example, you can load music for 30 minutes. Before you can start loading, the device must be in the Bluetooth mode. Double click the middle button to switch to Bluetooth mode or if your device has an M button, click the M button. Now, open your favorite music app on your phone and start playing the music. You should hear the music from the headphones. Then, as the music is playing, go back to the upload page and then click start. You will hear the announcement loading audio and the light will start blinking rapidly. After the set timer expires, the loading will stop, and the audio is stored in the device memory. Important, set the audio level high enough before you start loading, and keep your phone playing and close to the headphones. Audio is not loaded if you stop the audio from your phone or the Bluetooth is disconnected. Also, any incoming phone calls will pause the loading. Tip, you can also connect the headphones into a charger while it is loading audio. When connected to a charger, the headphones will load in silent mode. Managing audio files, to manage the audio files in the memory, switch the device to memory mode. In the library view, you will see three folders, my music, favorites, and load. For example, you can view loaded audio files, rename them, and then move them into a different folder. To rename a song, click the edit button, then click the three dots. This will bring a edit menu where you can choose to rename delete or move the file to another folder. On the library view, you can also create or add new folders by clicking the add folder plus button. Keep following the video to see these steps. Thank you. 